If you get a really strong immune system, this will protect your body from getting various infections like bacterial or viral infections. Watch the video till the end to know different tips of boosting immunity in natural way. Welcome to Dr. Hosni channel, this is Dr. Hosni. Here we will deal with different health topics and medical emergencies and how to face it in the proper way to stay safe and save lives. The immune complex in your body is made out of cells that found in the skin and mucous membrane, bone marrow and different organs and it protects your body from different pathogens like bacteria and virus and also different damages that happen to your body like burns and cancer. There are a lot of tips that can help in improving your immune system. One of them is sleeping well. Normal adults usually need about seven hours or even more to sleep, while teenagers might need more than that, might need eight hours to 10 hours of sleep, as good rest strengthens the immunity. And if you get troubles getting asleep, please watch your video. We leave the description up there. It might help you to sleep in an easy way. Another thing is eating whole plant food, like nuts, vegetables, and seeds. All this food is having substance called antioxidants, which reduce the inflammation in general by combating some com one compound which is called free radicals. The fibers in this food improve your gut microbiome or the bacteria flora, which in turn increase your immunity. Eat more healthy fats like what is found in olive oil and salmon. It also contains the omega-3, which reduce the inflammation in a significant way. Eat more fermented food like yogurt or kefir or take even probiotic supplements. This flourish the bacteria flora or the gut bacteria which help the immune system to differentiate between healthy cells and invader cells that need to be attacked. Although intense and prolonged exercise can reduce the immunity, yet moderate exercise can boost your own immunity. As moderate exercise can reduce the inflammation and improve the regeneration of the immune cells. And from this moderate exercise is jogging, swimming, light hiking, and walking even. And these exercises should be about 150 minutes per week. Be always hydrated. Despite the fact that hydration by itself doesn't have direct effect on the germs, yet keeping hydrated makes the function of the whole body working in a proper way. As a general guideline, you just drink when you are thirsty and stop when you are don't feel thirsty. But when you are doing an exercise or living in a hot climate, maybe you need more fluid intake. Manage your stress level. Prolonged stress can induce inflammation and imbalance in the performance in the immune cells. To know more about how to control your anxiety, especially in this atmosphere that we are living now, please click on the video above to see more details. Some supplements like vitamin C, vitamin D, elderberry, and zinc can be really helpful in boosting your immunity if you use it in a wise way and with some direction of your own GP of your or your doctor. So to face the coronavirus or the COVID-19, these tips might help, but it's not the treatment of COVID-19. And it should be working in parallel with the other protective measures like cleaning the hand and the social distance and the different measures. At the end, I wish you all to be staying home safely. And if you have any ideas about other topics to talk about, please write it in your own comments. Thank you so much and see you next episodes.